Hi guys, this is M Explains back with another video. If you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, please consider subscribing to the channel. And if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. In this video, I'll be talking about a freshman year design and engineering project, passive a rating system. Let me know about your project in the comments down below. If you're a mechanical engineering student, you must be familiar with the construction. Still didn't get it? Here is your first clue. Well, there you have a second clue. Still it's a no. Here is the third and last clue. And I'm sure you all got it. Yes, it has air vessels and it is something similar to hydraulic ram. Well, the construction of hydraulic ram is a topic for another video. So let me talk about this project. And before jumping onto the construction and working of this project, let me explain the use and advantage of this project. This passive aerating system can be used for aerating aquaculture ponds. The main advantage of this is it is totally off the grid. You don't have to use any electricity, gas, diesel or anything to power this. It's completely environment friendly and durable. Now let me explain how it works and the water, how it works. The water enters through this pipe along with some atmospheric air. When the water reaches the base region, the cross section area increases and the water expands. The air, being less denser than water, will be trapped in the air vessels. Later, the air can be collected for aerating agricultural ponds. Additional hoses can be drilled onto the air vessels to collect the collected air. All the materials required and the tools required for making this project is given in the description below. You can buy them off at any hardware stops and it is cheap and easy to find. If you have any other recommendation to this project, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.